In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to install any custom map that you want for Minecraft Xbox Bedrock Edition exactly like this one. Welcome back everyone, my name is Echo and I hope you're having a great day. Today's Minecraft video, it is a tutorial on how to get any map you want for free on Minecraft Xbox Bedrock. So over the past couple of months, you may remember these videos, how to install mods or add-ons for free on Xbox or how to get free Xbox skin packs and skins. So we're back again, I want to show you how to do the maps. Now I have a lot of respect for the people who release marketplace content. I have a bunch of friends who have released maps there. However, not everybody has the money to purchase maps and I feel there should also be free content as well as paid. So at the start of today's video, I showed you guys this map, which is Volcano Island. I'll try and leave a link down below. It's just a fully custom survival map that you can check out with your friends. But again, I'm gonna show you how to install any map, whether it's survival, creative, mini games, creations, anything you want at all. The only thing that's going to be paid is your Minecraft version. But if you had Minecraft Xbox edition, this version was free for you. All right, let's get into this. Do me a solid though. If this video does help you out, leave a like and share it. It helps other people find my channel and this specific video. Also, I'm doing this on version 1.16.210. This will work for 1.16, 210, 220 and any future versions as well. Maybe even beta. If you're in beta, try it out. So there is going to be three things that you need. Number one, of course, is going to be Minecraft. It has to be this version of Minecraft as Minecraft Xbox One edition was discontinued. You are going to need some form of browser. I've been using Microsoft Edge for all of these tutorials and I've had no issue at all. Well, any other browser will work as well. And you're going to need MC Add-ons Manager. Since my last video, the logo has changed, but it works the exact same. If you do not know how to get this, all you got to do is search for it on the Microsoft Store. But I'll show you just in case you haven't done it already. So on your Xbox, on the MC Store, just type in literally MC and it will be this one. It's pretty high up in the listing because it's very popular and a lot of people own it. Once you have Minecraft, your browser and MC Add-ons Manager, you're pretty good to go. So start off by opening your browser. There is three websites that I typically use. The first one is mcpedl.com. Really well known, really popular, and really easy to use. The second one is mcbedrock.com. And the third and final one is planetminecraft.com. One of the most well known websites for Minecraft for a very long time. Let's start off with mcpedl.com. Just go to your maps. Now you probably noticed that on the scroll down you can't really access everything. If you just tap on maps and then here you can actually tap on all of them. So if you wanted adventure, tap on adventure, creation, CTM, custom terrain. So for the sake of today's video, we'll start off with custom terrain. So I've just set mine to custom terrain and most popular for the month. Have a little bit of a look. It's going to take you quite some time until you find something you like. But I'm just going to keep going until I find something that I like. So this is the map that I showed you at the start of the video. Volcanic Island Survival, which is 1000 by 1000. So I'm going to show you how to do this again. So just tap on it. Typically the downloads for these, yeah, here's a, a little bit of a glimpse of what it's going to look like. Typically the downloads for these are right at the bottom. You're just going to simply click on this. It's going to notify you that you are leaving mcpedl.com. So you tap on this. This one is an AdFly link. Now sometimes they're AdFly links and sometimes they are link first links. If you see this at the bottom, if it does not say .mc world or anything Minecraft related, just get rid of this. Because for AdFly, we need to skip it. So tap on this. Once it loads, you should see this, which is a redirect link. It's going to take us to Mediafire, which is this one. And we tap on download. Now, once we tap on download, it's probably going to show you guys a couple of different ads. Just simply close them down until you get to this link, which as you guys can see at the bottom, it says the uh, abstraction.mc world. Don't download nothing. If you're downloading maps, that does not say .mc world. Now I don't control these links. Whoever makes these maps 
either share them on AdFly or Linkfair so they earn a little bit of revenue. For us who download this on Xbox, it's really annoying, so you're going to have to be patient at this stage. There is tons of maps on these websites that don't have AdFly links and Linkfest links and are a lot easier to use. So at this stage, we're simply just going to press save. Once you've done and it says open, we don't need to open it. You need to wait until at the bottom it says finished downloading. Don't press open, don't press open folder, and don't press view downloads. At this stage, we want to open the MC add-ons app. So once you're in the app, at the top it will say import. Tap on this. Now I've got a couple of things here, so we're just going to tap on the recent download, which was this one. It's going to say importation complete. Do you want to delete the source pack file? This is recommended to free up space. I just press yes. After you've done that, you're pretty good to go and to open Minecraft. So let's do it. So at this point, we just want to go to play and we just want to go to this one. Now, previously I deleted this world and uninstalled it. It's back to survival and back to normal difficulty and also back to nighttime. So when we load this, we're probably going to get attacked by a bunch of mobs. If you're checking out this map, run if you're checking it in survival. But if you're in creative, we're just going to go to creative and we're just going to go to normal and we're just going to load it up. Yep, as I mentioned, we're being attacked by a skelly bones. It is nighttime and we're in survival. But this is the exact same map that I showed you at the start. So just like that, that's how you install any custom map for free. I really like this one because I'm a survival player. And this is definitely something I would recommend checking out with your friends. Okay, let me show you guys one more time. So this time, we're going to check a map from mcbedrock.com. This map shares a lot of Minecraft Bedrock and Java news, mods, maps, add-ons, seeds, skins, you name it, you can check it out here. So if we go to maps, you can see all the categories down to MC World, PvP, Parkour, Adventure, Mini Games, Redstone Creations, Creative, Survival Maps, MC Templates, and Puzzle Maps. I want to share with you a map that me and my friend made ourselves. If you're a survival player, you're going to enjoy it. So this map is called Singularity Skyblock. It's what me and my buddy Stark TMA teamed up to make. Basically, it's a one block skyblock. You literally have just one block and you break it over and over and over again. And then you obtain more blocks and then build a skyblock. Cool thing about this is you can either start in the overworld or the nether since this was released around the nether update. Anyway, at the bottom, you'll see a couple of links. This is the direct download. Don't worry, we won't be offended if you click this link. So click this and it will open a Google Drive. So this is really simple. Don't get confused by all of this. This is just showing you guys what's available in the files. At the top right, you tap on this. Now this is going to open the download, which is just going to be a .mc world, which is this one. As you guys can see, skyblock.mc world. Click on save. Now we're good to go. So let's go to MC Add-ons Manager. Inside of here, like the previous steps, go to Import and go to the Singularity Skyblock world or any map that you're installing and click Yes, like previously. After this, you just got to load up Minecraft. Once Minecraft is open, go to Play and your map will be there. It might be a little bit further down in your list, but there is Singularity Skyblock. So let's load it up. So in this specific map, you have the option to click on this chicken and start in the overworld or this chicken to start in the nether. Both challenges are pretty fun. We're going to start with the overworld. So there's the MC Texels logo, full credit again to Stark TMA. And we literally just have this one block with the end portal below us. And how this works is you simply just break this and a new block appears. And you just keep breaking it over and over and over again. After a certain amount of blocks that have been broken, then the block will change. So it's it's really fun. It's really challenging. And it's definitely fun to check out with your friends. This is also really, really co-op friendly. One last map. I'm going to show you how to install mini games. We're going to install 10 ways to rage quit Minecraft. At the bottom is going to be a download. This one's really easy to use and only opens a media file link. So just tap on the download. Click save. And then open MC Add-ons Manager. Once again, go to Import and your map will be there. Like previously, once this is done, we're just going to open Minecraft. Go to Play and further down, 10 ways to rage quit Minecraft. Really simple, really easy to do. I hope this video does help you out if you have any problems at all. 
just leave a comment down below and I'll do my best to respond. So yeah, have a great day and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.